Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're playing South of Florida once again. Today I, I broke out of prison um, earlier today. And now we're just going to see what's going on around the town, city. And yeah, let's just drive around. I did buy a new car because as you guys know, my Nissan GTR got impounded from my last arrest. And yeah, let's just quickly drive around, see what we can find. At this point, I'm really sorry for the audio. This will go on for the rest of the video. Enjoy the video. Peace out. And, and enjoy your time. So I have the Huracan. I love the sound of this beast. This just sounds awesome. Um, all right, let's go. their day enjoying their time and yeah i'm just gonna wait at this red light something else happens i'm not sure sick people right there so many people have the the ads that i don't they have all right come on launch Using the code, um, using the code, uh, 10 mil, like this. So Twitter codes, you type in 10 mil, like this, and then it should work. I already redeemed it, so I can't use it anymore. But let's just go check out what cars they have. So we're just entering the thing right now. Let's go on to the classic cars. So I'm pretty sure one of them is the Chevy Camaro for 55.8K. Uh, so this car, let's check out the stats, it's, for, it's speed is not that, it's like halfway, acceleration is pretty good, it has, it weighs 3,296 3, pow, pounds, it has 430 horsepower and 460 torque, which is pretty awesome. Now for the Chevy, they had a Chevy Stingray, also really good, uh, it has 300 horsepower and 360 torque with the 375 horsepower, 380 torque and weight of 3,370 pounds. Rear wheel drive, pretty awesome. Now the Ford Mustang Boss, my, one of my all time favorites. 375 horsepower, 450 torque, and weight of 3,560 pounds, which is awesome. Wait, look guys, the Mustang cost, the Mustang Boss cost $215,000, that is insane. You guys are wondering, I have the um, Lamborghini Huracan Perfumante, which it's a her Wait, the Aventador is $298. No, it's not a bad price, honestly. Pretty good price for an Aventador. This is a new car they added for $1.1,000. Pretty good. They got, oh, look at this Aventador. Awesome Aventador. All right, let's head out, see what they've got. Um, 
All right, let's head out, boys. Okay. So I think I'm gonna go check out. Um, I don't think they've added anything much, but let's check it out anyways. So yeah. Just driving down the road. Uh, let's just walk in over inside Starblock, see if they got us. There's no one here, of course not. So I'm just grab a quick coffee. Let's grab one of these cake pops with the chocolate one. Um, yeah, I want to thank you guys again for 300, not 30 subscribers. My next goal is 50, and after that, 100 subscribers. If we can hit 100 subscribers by the end of the year, I will do a live stream. Yes, you hear me clearly. A live stream if I get 100 subscribers by the end of the year. Boy, don't you dare hit my car. I swear, you're a f like half a foot off my car. Sorry for the audio, but I'm going to to Seaside Beach. Enjoy. So as I'm driving to Seaside Beach, um, I just want you to guys to know that I'm really happy about what you guys have done from this past year and whatever since I've started my YouTube channel. Right now, I'm just at the bar, probably not the bar, but the Seaside Cafe uh, Beach place. Uh, just giving you guys a tour because the audio from this was really loud and I didn't like how it sounded. As you guys know, earlier in the video, it also has... I forgot to edit that. I'm really sorry. But for now, I'm just going to talk um, the, record, the, the after recorded audio for now. So right now, I'm just sitting here waiting for this guy to finish. And in a few seconds, um, he's going to say that he only sells tea. And coffee, which I'm not sure why this seaside grill thing only sells tea and coffee. Uh, once again, I'm really sorry for the audio. I'll try to do my best uh, in my next episode. And yeah, I just want you guys to know, thank you so much for the 30 subscribers. It means a lot to me. Uh, enjoy your day. And yeah, let's just go on with the um, recording right now. Really just tea and coffee? Why? You know what? Why does this guy only sell tea and coffee? Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna leave right now. Do why only tea and coffee, man? So this mean this guy just leave the restaurant at this point. And I noticed that he has a C8, but before I did too, I just forgot to script it. And I'm thinking, what if we race him, right? So we start heading over to the hotel on the other side of Seaside Grill. Um, it's like right here and I noticed him following me and I think I might just race him so I'm wondering right now let's just show you guys uh, the inside right so I'm entering the Gulf Paradise um, condos right now and I'm heading to the seventh floor and 
As we're heading up the elevator, I will go to the left to pick my room, which it's... I like the houses in this game because they're pretty interesting. And as I enter my room at the number of 703, I turn on the lights. Okay, so as I turn the lights on, um, I just give you guys a tour of my kitchen right now. So there's this, uh, like there's some bread there. We have a nice stove and a microwave and fridge. We have a nice living room over here with a nice TV. And over here, as you guys know, haha, <laughs> work, zoom, you know how the, yeah, you guys know what happened, right? And then this is the second bedroom. This is not the master. I think it might be the master. I'm not really sure, but that's all. I just, yeah, this is, yeah, you, you guys get it, right? So this is the master. And as I walk over to the bathroom right now, it's pretty nice, but this is the master right here. This is the master, the actual master bedroom. Uh, it's really nice. And I really like this bedroom because one, each uh, one of these condos actually comes with a balcony. Yes, you hear me right, a balcony. And I really like it because you can see the whole hotel view. And when it's, when the sunset comes out, it's really enjoyable, which I just love. Uh, and as I am guessing, uh, I walk out I just had to my kitchen real quick and walk out of my house right now. I still notice the guys down there in the C8 and I'm thinking to myself, what if we race him, right? So I ask him to race and he's just talking to someone else. Then about 10 seconds later, he answers me. Sure. Why not? Right? Uh, yeah. So yes, he says sure right here. So we're just going to race. Right now, so I told him to follow me, but I misspelled. You guys know that, right? And so I hop in my Lambo and I find, I'm thinking to myself, what if I just drive down the road and find the perfect spot to race? So I start driving out of the parking lot, you know, skirt, skirt, vroom, vroom. And I take a left down and I go all the way down the road with the C8 behind me. At this point, I'm thinking, the C8 probably has a pretty big engine and I might actually get beaten, but I'm like, believe in yourself, bro. You got this. It's a Lamborghini against a Corvette. Yeah, Corvette's, you know, Chevy's pretty strong, which I love. And as he pulls up to the starting line, I tell him that we're going to race to the end of the street. And yeah. So here, just tell him I'm going to honk three times. And on the third honk, we will go. And at this point, I start revving up my engine, honk three times and launch the car. As I pull away, the court, the C8 actually kind of, I mean, if you, I don't know if you just say caught up, but it's actually doing pretty well. Uh, but right there in the distance, you guys see it. Um, I start steering, almost lose control. And I just, keep I just keep driving to the end of the road. And then I start slowing down about right here. So I start slowing down and I notice the C8 pull up behind me and just pass me. Hits the sign and flies over the ramp into the bushes. I'm thinking to myself, what if he's hurt? And indeed he wasn't hurt, which... That's pretty good, honestly. Um, so I just pull up here. He wants to hear my car. And yeah, so at this point, I pull up to the parking lot and um, say to G, like, you know, good sportsmen do. And then he asks me if he, if he wants to let ref my car. Once again, I am really sorry guys for the audio. Thanks for 30 subscribers. Hope you guys are crushing life. Enjoy your day. Peace out. Bye. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like button, subscribe. Peace out. Have a great day.